Yo, what's up, everybody? What's up, what's up? Um, this is Jonah, y'all. And I'm back, y'all, with another video. Another truthful meshes. And this is the another eye-opening meshes. And this is the crazy meshes. I'm going to talk about all type of stuff that's really going on. Parents raising their kids to be the cheater. Parents, parents just raising their kids to be a hooker. Teaching children do the wrong thing they should not to. I'm going to talk about this for a minute because, you know, people, people claim themselves they follow God. They're so afraid to speak truth about all type of stuff what's going on. People so scared to just talk about things. Don't even think about making a video all type of things what's going on. So I guess I'm the main one doing videos and just put it out there, man. You know, I'm going to talk about. Parents not supposed to teaching their children how to cheat one another. Practicing doing something or uh, sexual reality to somebody they should not to. Okay? I'm going to talk about this, okay? Because this is sick and, and you know, and that's got to stop. Okay, and I'm going to speak truth about this because God is angry. God finna destroy America, you know, because God getting tired of that. People just living the backward ways. Okay, that's right, man. I, I, I gotta, I gotta say this again, man. I gotta say it again. Parents not supposed to raising their children to teach the children how to cheat. Practicing doing something they should not be doing. Okay. And this is not right. You know. And majority of parents. They should have been in jail. For doing that kind of stuff like that. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead and just give y'all the scriptures in a moment. Okay. Some of y'all questions said, well, JC, what is going on? Why are you making videos about this? Uh, first thing this, y'all. If you're not spiritual, this message is not for you. If you are that person don't care about what's going on with the world we live in, this video is not for you. If you are the person continue playing games with your life, this message is not for you. If you are that person continue to follow the uh, uh, pagan lives of the religions, this message is not for you. If you are that person make jokes in my videos, this message is not for you. If you are the if you are that person continue to be afraid to speak the truth, this message is not for you. If you are the person scared to go up higher and higher and higher in the kingdom of God today, this video in this message is not for you. This message is for a spiritual people only, okay? I'm going to talk about all type of stuff, man. How parents just raising their kids in the wrong way. Don't even think about teaching their children in the right way. Still to do the wrong way. You know, um, it's just it's ridiculous, man. My fiance, she told me left or right, left or right things I just don't want to hear. But it just really just coming to my attention. You know what I'm saying? She told me all type of stuff. It's a talk about her mama is a cheater. They want, they want her to be just like her mom and all that kind of stuff. So I start questioning my, my girl say, do you want to be like your mama? She say, no, I don't want to be a cheater like her. I ain't not making babies with different kind of baby daddies like that, you know what I'm saying? And and I say, okay, then you know, then why are you telling me this? I said, John, I just want you to know this, you know what I'm saying? And my mama used to be a cheater. You see what I'm saying? That's what she told me. I ain't made things up, and I, and I and I and I didn't know that. So you know what I mean? So <laughs> so they mean they 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 really means like they want her daughters to do the same thing what her mama be doing. Making babies with a different kind of dudes, man. You know what I'm saying? Had sex with a dude. Get pregnant. Get with the other good dude. And get pregnant. And get with the third dude. And get pregnant. What is going on with these people, man? These people are sick. Especially ladies. Ladies are sick. Then they got some brothers out there more sick than the ladies, man. Most sick, man. Most brothers out there just had sex with the first woman. Second woman, third and fourth, got them pregnant. Then they got some sick men do the same thing too, man. You know, my old lady, my old lady, she used to be sick. You know what I'm saying? Now she, she, you know, she met that guy named Corey. You know, she got another baby. You know, but she got, she got, she got two kids. It was me 
there was a other dude. You know what I'm saying? But she don't want to live like that. You know what I'm saying? She ain't trying to be like her uh, uh, other people be doing. You know what I'm saying? Her mom, her mother, her mama just raised the kids to be a hooker, to be a cheater, to be a nasty, just going around the street and start having sex, making money like that, man. That's sickly, man. And you know what I mean? That's what God was angry about. God finna destroy America, man. You know what I'm saying? And I have a dreams about that. God is really wanting to destroy the world, man. And, and I really don't blame him. I had so many dreams, man. Couple of couple of months ago, couple of years ago, you know what I'm saying? Cause the world we live in, man, it just it just you know what I mean? It just full of corrupt. It's just full of wicked, man. You know what I'm saying? And just God is just getting tired of that. And you know what I mean? I'm getting tired of that. I'm see that's the reason why I can't be friends with nobody, y'all. I'm just keep it real. I cannot be friends with people. Keep the doing the same crap, man. You know what I'm saying? I, I got to start hanging out with, with my friends. Only I can hang out with my ordained friend from L.A. His name's UC. I can hang with them. Instead of hang with other people, man. Because other people, they don't even have God. They lying themselves, talk about they got God, and they still do the worldly things, man. Even Jesus say, do not be entered to this world. You see what I'm saying? Then Jesus say, do not be in this world. Because the world we live in, that's Satan's kingdom. That's Satan's kingdom. That's the worldly people they live in. Smoking weed. Going to clubs. Party. Balling. Get with this cursed relationship. All that kind of stuff, man. I used to, I, man, let me be honest with myself. I used to done it all the time. I used to run around streets, hang out with my friends. Get drunk, smoke weed, and all that stuff, and, and look what happened to me. My stomach hurt. God is angry with me. My stomach hurt, and I start throw up, and I and I feel a little sick. So God must be talking to me. God must be angry with me. God just give me a warning sign. Do not do the same stuff again. God was angry with me. I don't care what people say. <laughs> God is angry with me. That's why my stomach hurt real bad. And, and I went and I went home, man. I was starting to throw up, man. And I was about to, I was almost throw up on the bus. I almost, I almost, man. And I went home and I started to throw up, man. I was feeling real, real bad, like I'm pissed out, y'all. I ain't tell you no stories, man. I ain't tell you no lies, man. I used to drink beer and smoking weed at the same time with, with, with my buddy buddies, man. I wasn't even thinking, y'all. You know what I mean? How you going to talk about God and you smoking weed and drinking beer? <laughs> it don't make sense, y'all. You know what I mean? That's worldly days y'all be do doing things like that. And you talk about you walking with God. You see what I'm saying? And I'm, I'm, just, I'm just being real honest, y'all. But back to this message, man. Parents out there just, you know, raising their kids. You go ahead, just do this. Go ahead, say the bodies. Making money, help me out with rent and all that stuff. Go ahead, sell sell pussy for everything. You know what I'm saying? You know, you got some parents do that to the daughters. Real life, man. And, and now I'll just start making shows, memorial shows, Stevie Welcome shows. They start push shows, man. You know, people going, you got some people, their family sue their parents to make their daughters be, be on the streets or still selling bodies. They sue, they sue their parents. I don't blame them. They're them for doing that kind of stuff to your own kids to raise their children to be a whore. And I'm going to tell you what's going to happen, man. I'm going to tell you what's going to happen. Now they got some women out there between 18 and 19 years old raised up. Let me tell you something. I'm gonna, I got to say like this, man. This is my own walks with God, the way, the way I look at things. Because... I'm looking at things different than y'all, because I'm different than y'all, man. You know what I'm saying? I don't care what people going to say to me or not, because I really don't give a shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm just be real honest, y'all. The way I look at things, you know, differently, they got so, so many teenagers out there on the street, sleep with the other man, first man, and the second and the third and fourth man, she be having HIV. Sad, man. They got some women's out there in this world. You know, New Orleans even more worse. Even Los Angeles even worse. Sometimes Texas. Even Chicago. People just be walking around. Man, they got some young girls walking around just doing something that should not be been doing. Selling bodies. 
have sex with a man, get with another man, get with another man, get with another man, and start having a baby. Don't even know who the baby is, or who the baby father is. You see, you see how sad it is. Now her, she make herself miserable because she she do some messed up stuff like that. And I'm gonna say the getaway. They got some women out there just do some stupid ass shit like that, man. Stupid ass shit. Fucked up shit what she did. Put a pussy on a man. Get pregnant. Put a pussy in another man. Get pregnant. She don't have no clue who the baby father really is. Just because she had a child, son and a daughter. Sad, y'all. You know what I mean? I ain't supposed to be cursing y'all. I'm just speak truth, man. They got some girls out there doing that kind of stuff, man. You know what I mean? Parents just parents, you know what I mean? Parents do the same thing. Now they got their children like that. Now they got some fathers out there. Be a player over the woman. Mess around with other women. You know what I'm saying? Looking for looking for pussy to fuck. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> same thing. I have a brothers like that, man. Get with the other girl, 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 get pregnant, don't want to take care of the baby, and all this and that. You know, I have a brother on my daddy's side, take care of the daughter. That was good. I just gave him pops. You know, my brother, uh, my brother Al, man, I give him a, I, I give him a shout out because cause he take care of the baby. And he take care of this woman. That's a real man. And see, other men's out there, man, they cut through. All they do is just run around the street, mess around with girls. You know, they got some parents out there do the same thing. Got your own son like that. See, that's what happened. Parents never think about raising their kids in the right way. Look what happened. Your son and your daughter is getting all worse. And all of a sudden, they got some parents teach the children to do all kind of stuff, stuff that they should not be doing. You know, my old lady, let me say something. My old lady keep telling me things about her mama. She used to be a cheater. She want her to be just like her. And that was so sad. Her mama in New Orleans just, she, you know, my baby mama told me all type of stuff. Say, said, yeah, babe, my mama, she want me to be just like her. She want me to, she want me to be a cheater just like her. I say, really? I say, yeah, but I'm not going to do it to you, Jonah. I'm not going to do it to you, John, because I don't want to hurt you. Because, see, my mama, she don't give a damn. She don't give a damn hurt that guy feeling. So that's so I see what's coming from. So that means your mama don't give a damn about their feelings. All that do just has sex with a different man, make it a baby with the first man, and the second and the third and the fourth. That means parents parents ain't supposed to be teaching their children. They should not supposed to be not to. You know, and I sit there and stop thinking, man, it got to be the Jezebel spirit. It got to be, man. It got to be, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to go ahead and just give you all the scriptures, man, because, you know, I'm, I'm going to talk about this, man. Book of Revelation, chapter 2, verse 20. That's what God was talking, man. That was God was talking. But I had this against you that you tolerate that spirit of Jezebel who called herself a prophet, okay? Talk about a Jezebel, okay? Jezebel, you already know how Jezebel is. She's an evil, wicked woman. She's a hoe. She hate God. She hate God's truth. She she killed God's prophet. She's an evil, wicked woman. You know, she's lust. You know, she, she producing people and teaching people do the wrong thing just like their parents do, just like my baby mama. Mama cheats her daughter how to cheat, doing things they should not be doing. And that was so sad. It got to be the Jezebel. They got so many Jezebel people in this world, y'all. And, and, and even it, even Ahel, too. Got Ahel spirit in the world, too. And I'm going to read the whole thing, okay? Go to the book of Revelation, chapter 2, verse 20. But I have this against you. That's God's talking. That's Jesus talking, okay? But I have this against you that you tolerate that woman Jezebel, who calls herself a prophet, and this teaching and producing my servants to practicing sexual reality and do eating for sacrifice to idols. And I'm gonna read again. Y'all need to listen to me. 
or you can write the notes if you want to. You can write it down if you want to. This is real, y'all. This is real, man. But I have this against you that you tolerate that woman, Jezebel, who called herself a prophet and is teaching, is producing my servants to practicing sexual reacting and to eat food sacrificed to idols. Okay? Now they got some people in the world doing that kind of stuff like Jezebel be doing. See what I'm saying? You know, they teach the, they teach the people to do the wrong thing. Just like their parents teach their children how to cheat. They, they teach their children how to practice in having sex and all that kind of stuff. That's not right. You know? And I'm just thank God I got my mama, man. She never raised me like that. And I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you a secret, man, about my dad. My dad got me watching porno since I was since I was 14 years old. I ain't I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Now I got my own daddy, man. You know we was living in Kenner, Louisiana. My daddy got me watching pornos. I was even I was even I was even interested in watching porno because I was I was in Christian. You know I go to church every single Sunday and I was young and I got baptized in water and I was six years old. You know what I'm saying? And I was a Christian. I ain't gonna lie to you. I was a Christian. I go to church every single Sunday. My mama raised me up to be in the church and all that stuff, you know what I'm saying, when I was when I was a kid, you know what I mean? You know, my mom raised me up when I was a kid, and I was in California, and now my mama take me and my brother back to New Orleans, you know, and I start going to church again, you know. But anyway, my, my dad, he got me, and my, one of my brothers been watching pornos, woman suck the man off, and all that, all that all type of stuff. You know, I was even, I was even, I was even I was even interested in watching that stuff, you know what I'm saying? And and I, I get used to that watching that stuff, you know what I'm saying? See, that's what happened. They got some men out there just let your children teach your children how to do things they should not be doing, y'all. You see me personally, man, if you know what I mean, since I got me a son, you know, I don't do that to my son like that. I ain't never let my son watch opponents like that. No, that's common sense, y'all. That's common sense. If I find now my baby mama wicked sister, my son be be a pimp, be a gangster. I'm not gonna be too happy, man. See, that's the reason why I don't trust her sister. I don't, I don't trust her. I don't support her at all because I know how she operates. I know. I'm studying her real good. You know, I don't hate her, y'all. Y'all think I hate my baby mama's sister. I got, you know what I mean. I forgive her. I got love for her, but I, 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 I lost all respect for her. All that crap she be doing, man. I hope my son not to be just like her. You know. I hope not. My baby mama told me my son sounds like her sister, and I was and I was mad. You know what I'm saying? You know. But anyway, but anyway, I hope my son ain't gonna be like them, man. If if I find out, I want them sue them, make them have a lawsuit. You know what I mean? You know, cause they ain't got no right to raise somebody else's kids to be the gangster. That's not right, man. That's not right. That's disgrace, y'all. That's disgrace. You ain't supposed to be raised somebody else's kids to be a badass. No, man. You ain't supposed to be raised somebody else's kids to be a hooker, to be a whore, to be a pimp, to be, to be, uh, you know what I'm saying, to be um, lesbian and all that, all, all type of stuff, man. A bug dag and all that stuff, man. Man, don't make, man, don't make me find now, man. I'm going I'm to find now for sure, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to find out if my son got something in him, I'm, I'm, I'm super going to be mad, y'all. That's the reason why I don't trust her family at all. I don't care what they say, man. I don't trust them, man. I don't trust them. I sat for one in, I sat for one in Georgia. You see what I'm saying? Man, I just had to do this video, man. You know, parents not supposed to cheat their children to, 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 cheat, to cheat other people. You know what I'm saying? You ain't supposed to be tell your daughter, I don't want you to be with that person. I want you to cheat. I want you to cheat with your boyfriend and find somebody else like that. That's that's not that's not, you know what I mean? To me, it's man, my own opinion, my own walks with God. This is not right. This is not right, y'all. This is not right. To me, this is not right for 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 mothers to tell their daughter to cheat on me. No, man. To me, it's man, this is not right, y'all. You know what I mean? Yes, I take things seriously, man. You see what I'm saying? Y'all God's people, y'all know where I'm coming from, man. Y'all ain't supposed to be raise your children 
to do the wrong thing. Y'all supposed to be raise your children and do the right thing. You're supposed to be raise your children about God, not this world. Even Jesus said, do not be into to this world because God separate for the world. Y'all know what I'm saying, y'all. And I just had to do this video, just put it out there the best I can. Parents not supposed to teach their children how to cheat, how to doing something they should not be doing, having sex, and and, and dig uh, job job dig it dig it whatever whatever it is, man. They should not be doing. I just had to do the videos, man, and to just put it out there, man. Since excuse me, since nobody don't want to talk about this. And leave that alone, man. This is JCR, and I'm just hit y'all with some stuff, man. I'm about to be out, y'all. Peace.